I'ma walk in erection Spit without a thought, we do it reckless Your nigga call us texting You say, baby, don't be mad, you know how pretty it is Hey y'all, I'm vlogging on my phone because my camera is downstairs and I done been up and down these steps too many times today. So yeah, so as y'all can see, um, the room is coming together. Dre is just doing the last finishing touches. Yeah, just do over there by the door too. Like all the way up, all the way up on the corners. Um, Dre is just doing the finishing touches on the wall. So, yeah, I mean, the room is pretty much done. You put the new AC in. I'm about to order some blinds and curtains and a curtain rod just to, like, keep the sun out because, y'all, when I tell y'all it's so hot in here, I need this AC to kick in, like, immediately. But everything's pretty much done. I've set the mop. We're going to put the bed and the box spring down tonight, bring the dresser up and bring the TV up just for now. And then um, maybe, I'm gonna say maybe next week, we'll start with making the bed frame because I don't wanna rush into that. I want the bed frame to come out exactly how I want. That's pretty much how it's going. I'm excited. So excited, it looks so good. Y'all know I wanted to do like line wash on this back wall. I still might do it, I don't know. But we'll see. It's not really important right now, so. I just think that the line box will look really nice in here. So tired. We had a long day. Um, the guy that was doing the room, he's a family friend like y'all know. So we were up here helping him. I did the call on the baseboards and everything. Looks really nice. Everything is, you know, coming together. I'm so hot and tired. That is pretty much what today really consists of. Just getting this room together because we need it together. I really love the way that the floor came out as well. It looks really nice. It's just really my style. So I'm, I'm happy about it. I'm excited. Can't wait to see how I decorate. But the theme in this room is definitely going to be black, tan, and greenery. So it's kind of giving like farmhouse. And that's just like my vibe. Like I like clean, cleanness. I may add like a few dark colors in here as well but I'm not too sure yet like besides the black we'll see I have to go on Pinterest and look at some ideas so yeah that's pretty much it for now my arm is about to fall off yeah okay bye shelves right across here we still gotta do one more paint i think i'm gonna do four shelves one two three four but the floor looks good i gotta figure out what to do with this little corner but yeah Hey y'all, what's up? If you're new here, my name is Ashika Lee. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you for spending the block, girl. 
So, as y'all can see, your girl is fully moved in. If y'all are all cut up, y'all know I've been moving and I've just been bringing y'all through the process. So, we're in the new room and she's pretty much all done. The last night, we brought the mattress up, the dresser from the apartment, and the TV that was in the living room is now in my room. So, we have some boxes to bring up. We have to pack the dresser in. We have some... I can't really put my clothes away yet because my second room is going to be my custom closet. And that is nowhere near done yet. We haven't even cleared out the second room yet. So, that's still work in progress. But like I said, I'm going to bring you all along the way. I did bring up like a little bit of decoration, I guess. Just to not make the room look so plain those are my olive trees from the apartment y'all know i had three but i just brought two with me um just to add like some type of spice to what we already have going on here i did end up getting blinds from walmart last night as well but i got the wrong lift <laughs> so the blinds don't come all the way down so i have to get new blinds i also got a curtain rod but i'm not too sure what type of curtain i want um for the room like the color i'm still contemplating maybe lime washing the back wall so that i can have an exit wall um and yeah i'm gonna get a new dresser so my theme in here is definitely gonna be like farmhouse beige black white nude green um maybe some browns and yeah that's pretty much what i'm rocking with i mean we have a lot to do but again i'm not rushing it because y'all moving is <sighs> moving is exhausting okay i woke up this morning feeling like i was fighting last night like my back hurt my feet hurt so bad i had this um massager on my feet last night that my mom my mom left and i think i overdid it with the massager on my feet because i can barely walk on my right foot like it hurts so bad like my my toenails is chipping I haven't gotten like everything just hurts moving is exhausting but it makes it a lot smoother and a lot better when you have people that can help you and right now the only person I have to help me is my man so I know he's tired of me I know he's tired <laughs> I know he's tired of me but that's okay it's all right so today what we have on the agenda it is going to rain all week so I don't know how productive this uh, week is going to be with like doing things outside and stuff. But I do have a few things on my schedule that I want to do uh, for this week. My hair is not done. So that's one thing I want to tackle. I want to do my hair because I don't feel... With just like the movement process, obviously I'm not worried about how I look. Because who cares? You know, I got, I got stuff to get done. But I still want to feel presentable like... I washed and blow dried my hair and put it in a bun and it looks a mess like it looks like I've been sweating so bad like carrying furniture and just trying to organize everything so your girl looks a mess but I want to do my hair I maybe want to go to like an exercise class this week I want to go out to lunch with one of my girlfriends to catch up I want to get this room somewhat finalized um, with like decor things like that the good thing is that I don't really need to go shopping for anything because I already had everything. But I did uh, downsize my bed, so instead of my king size, I have a queen size. So we have to build our, I have to build my bed frame, and I have to get new sheets that actually fit because I have my king size bed sheets on my queen size. Obviously, that's not going to work. So it's just a few things that we have to get done. Oh, and we have to go to the grocery store today okay because i need to get some things i have to get my coffee that y'all know i love to drink just like a few things that you know i like it is about to rain so i know i'm gonna get caught in rain so i need to hurry up and get out of here so that was a long intro but i had to catch y'all up y'all see the paint on my bonnet child i was getting in the feel i don't want to rush to get anything done like i don't want to stress myself out any more than i need to Everything will eventually get done. That's it. Period. Uh, my main concern is that second room, though. It is a mess. When I tell you, it's just a lot of stuff in there. But I can't wait to put the flooring down. Did I show you all the floors? Let me show you. Like, look at these floors. They look so good. The color, the oak, the tan. I love it. I love it. 
just got out the shower. It's time to go to the grocery store. So let's go. All right, y'all. So we are here at Aldi. I look insane. I threw a hat on because my hair is obviously a mess. Okay. It's a lot of people here. I'm about to run in there and get a few things. So let's go. Wait, let me find my quarter. Y'all know Aldi. Gotta put, gotta put the quarter in the cart. Then a few hours later, the fridge is all cleaned out and organized. I organized everything. Now I'm about to make me a tuna salad. I already boiled my eggs. I cleaned up and everything. I'm starving. I'm hungry. So I'm about to make this really quick. And I'll probably head upstairs and start organizing my drawers. Oh, and I had um, organized some of the cabinets, like all of my Tupperware stuff that I have. And I brought some of my glasses and things like that so i did put those away y'all i also picked up this vital life pineapple mango organic sparkling probiotic drink and this tastes so good Yeah, I just went to Wingstop. They're having these 70 cent wings. I did not know about them. And I got some free fries too. So that was nice. Y'all, I actually ended up getting Wingstop. And I don't really, I don't know. It's like I don't like Wingstop. I don't like Wingstop. Because every time I get it, I just be so disappointed. But every time I go on TikTok and they're doing the mukbangs, they're always eating Wingstop and it be looking so good. But it's like every time I get it, it don't be hitting. I don't know what it is. And I disappoint myself every single time. But hopefully this time is good. Got my water though. I'm I didn't I'm not drinking no soda or nothing, especially because I'm eating bad and it's late. Got spicy Korean and I just got hot honey rub. It looks so good. Let's see what it's hitting for. This is a spicy Korean and then this is the hot honey rub. Here go the fries, the ranch. Okay. Hmm. Now I gotta eat cute because I can't get none of this on my bed. Okay, the sheets literally just came out of the dryer last night. All right, first test taste. We got to do, take the ranch cover off. Just throw that in the bag. Okay, all right. I go to hot honey rub. Dip into that ranch. Could use a little bit more honey, but it's good. Not bad. And I'm about to eat, watch power, start editing, do my dresser. Um, I was supposed to pack up my dresser tonight, but I really don't feel like it. I'm so tired. Y'all, we were up until four in the morning last night, moving the dresser, the TV, you know, waiting for the bed sheets to dry, and we tired okay i'm tired i just want to chill tonight i might edit and watch power we've actually restarted power which is kind of crazy but we just miss seeing ghosts on tv power book 2 was really good too but um yeah we started watching power from season one and it is so good such a good show um so yeah we're gonna binge watch this eat eat my food and 
just chill if i do decide to do my dress my drawers tonight then i'll do that but i do need to edit a video because it has to go live tomorrow and i also have a meeting tomorrow as well with a company not a company but like a a collaboration type of thing so i have a meeting tomorrow around one o'clock and i'm excited i'm so excited for that I'm not playing. I'm going to get some good rest tonight so that I can wake up in the morning and do what I have to do. That second room needs to get cleared out. My clothes, the, the boxes just need to disappear. Like, I'm tired of looking at them. And that's it. That's all. So, yeah, we have a lot to do tomorrow. But it's literally going to rain for the whole week. Literally the whole week. All the way up until Friday, which sucks. But it is what it is. Good night. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Morning. So, as y'all can see, um, woke up. I did exactly what I said I was gonna do last night. I, um, well, I'm lying. I did everything except do my drawers. So I might do that today. It's good. So what I'm about to do right now is I'm about to get. This corner together just because I want to use my uh, end table that was in my living room. Um, just so that I can have... Yo, I was cleaning out my cabinets and look what I found. I found one of my favorite scents ever from Bath & Body Works. This is the Cactus Blossom Fresh Candle. And I think this is the gift that one of my friends got me for my birthday. And I never got a chance to use it because I already had like two full ones. And I just forgot about it. So... I'm about to like this but i want to put it on this table so that it's not directly on the floor or it's not in front of the tv i definitely want to get my bed frame together i don't know what we're gonna do that i'm thinking of possibly if we have the time we could like start it today um we'll see we'll see what happens because it's still a lot to do but yeah i'm about to set this corner up and corner this actually was like my old closet but I never really used it so I just knocked the closet out and then kind of just like made this opening in here I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do in this corner I was thinking maybe I could put like a little chair here but I don't want it to be too cluttered um so yeah we'll see we'll see we'll see we'll see we'll see I do have a black shelf that I was thinking maybe I could put here as well but I'm not too sure about that either. Anyways, let's just get this. How did y'all do this? Okay. So this is the top. Where it is? The Wi-Fi extender but I'm walking past the book section and I read Icebreaker I read um 
what's what's the what's the one with um what did I read? Icebreaker. I read after I read. I don't know. This has gotten so many good reviews, and it's thirty percent off. Good. It's good. <laughs> it's good. Yeah. You read it? I read it, and it's coming out. I guess I don't know in a couple weeks or this week. The movie. The movie. Yeah. Let me see that one. Thank you. I think I'm gonna get it. I heard a lot of good things about this, but I have to finish my other book. Twisted Games, and then we're gonna start with this. It has been um, a few hours later. I did pretty much all the errands that I had to do. I went to Target to get the um, I went to get the range extender. So I'm currently trying to set this up right now. For that I went to Home Depot to get the plugs and stuff that y'all seen. And then after that, I had to stop at the UPS store to make a return for Amazon. Then I went to Walmart to also make a return for the curtain rods. And I tried to get the correct length of curtain rod. And I tried to get the correct length for the curtain rod that I need, but they didn't have it. So I just made the return and left. My cramps started killing me. So I knew I just needed to come home, eat something, and lay down, which I did. And, and then I did Bible study. And Bible study was really good. We studied Mark chapter 1. Um, and it kind of brought us back to Genesis. And then we went from Genesis to... Uh, I don't remember. But yeah, we read from Mark chapter 1. And then it brought us back to Genesis chapter 3. And we kind of just were discussing, asking questions and things like that. That was our first time doing it, like from my church. So it was really good. I feel like the more that we do it, the more comfortable we'll get with like asking questions and you know being upfront with the things that we don't really understand. So first time it was really good. Enjoyed Bible study. Um, I'm happy that it's a young and youth, like a young adult and youth type of thing because to me, I remember going to Bible study with my mom and I just didn't understand. It wasn't a place that we would want to be we just went because obviously we had to go but it wasn't for us it was for like the older people so i don't really have like i don't want to say a good taste but my remembrance of bible study isn't that it's supposed to be fun or like entertaining or anything like that so i'm happy that this was the complete opposite of what i've experienced not actually going for myself but just like going as a child and not knowing much so it was really good um looking forward to the next one so i took a shower got myself together um and yeah i'm about to lay down i'm going to edit my vlog um i did want to put this big box of clothes away in a drawer tonight main y'all my bed is on the floor <laughs> But it's actually not bad. Like, I'm not mad at it. But, like I was saying, I'm actually going to edit. And uh, I think I might put something on the TV. I'm not sure. But normally when I watch TV while I edit, I don't really get much done. So, I don't know if I'm going to do that. Definitely have to edit. I have to get back on my Zoom, y'all. I have so many vlogs to edit. It makes no sense. Like, I have about three vlogs that I need to edit. So I need to stop playing. Oh, I'm sorry, y'all. I forgot to tell you guys about the meeting, I think, that I had today. I think it went really well. I asked questions that, you know, I needed to know. They got to know me as well. Um, but it is still something that I'm a little iffy with. So I'm going to sleep on it. I'm going to pray on it. And I'm just going to do whatever God tells me to do. Um, I'm asking for guidance and just to know, like, if this is something that I even want to do for myself. Um, I'm trying to think long term so yeah we'll, we'll see we'll see we'll see what happens but the meeting actually did go very well I am looking forward to it if all goes well then this will be like my first like sponsorship to where 
I've always envisioned in a way, but I just need to know if it's a right fit for me. Because one thing about me, I'm not going to just do something just because, um, just because, like, I'm not going to do that. So if I'm going to do anything, it's because I truly want to, and it's because, like, if I'm going to work with any company, it's going to be because I actually want to, or I actually like, you know, what they're promoting, things like that. So I just have to ask myself the tough questions. That's all. But yeah, the meeting went well. I'm excited about that. Yeah, we need to get to work. Y'all, I'm still trying to get used to white walls. I've never had white walls a day in my life, like ever. I've always had gray or I've had like, I remember I had purple at a young age because purple was like my favorite color, but I've never had white. I've always had like gray walls. So this is like, I don't know, it's just really bright. Like I'm not like a bright person on walls like I like dim colors so this is very new to me so I'm still trying to get used to it but yeah I don't know white walls are obviously clean but in my opinion it just looks it also just looks very blank like there's there's I feel like I have to do so much on the walls or put so much everywhere so that it can have some type of character I feel like white is just so plain so I don't know. Maybe later down the line, I might add some color on the walls. We'll see. We'll see. But right now, this is what your girl is doing. Video is currently importing right now, so it's going to take quite a while. I don't like editing until the importing is done because sometimes it can mess up like the um, the reading of the SD card and just like the transfer and everything like that. So I'll have to wait until it's fully imported that way everything will be less chaotic so while that's importing i'm going to fold the rest of my i'm gonna put i'm gonna put all of these clothes that are in this box in my dresser just so that i can be productive because i prefer to just lay here and scroll on tiktok until the video has imported but no with me i'm not gonna know how to stop and lock my phone i don't know if that happens to anybody else but like when you are on tiktok it's like you just be scrolling next thing you know it's two in the morning and you've been doing this you've been doing this the whole time like crazy just got done with my clients and we have some packages from Amazon so I'm going to show y'all what we got okay so these packages are actually for the kitchen sorry the um the kettle is on because I'm making some coffee but I'm doing it a little different this morning uh, I just got done with my clients well it's afternoon now it's 2 30 so um yeah, let me show y'all what I got. This is actually for the kitchen. We're actually upgrading the kitchen. So, as y'all can see, some of the cabinets do not have the handles on them. That's because the 30-pack that we bought just wasn't enough. So, we had to wait for the second pack to come in. And it just came in. So, I'm actually going to put them on myself like I did the rest of them. And we also got a new... We also got a new kitchen faucet. So we got it in black because I feel like the accent color in the kitchen 
is black. So, oh, this looks nice. Ooh. Yeah, this looks really nice. Very chic. And I think this is gonna look so nice right here. We also got the soap dispenser, but that doesn't come until Friday. But this, this looks so good. The tools that you need, the hot and cold pipes. And then this obviously to connect everything that you need to it. Um, we also have someone coming today to put in some recess lights for the kitchen. The lighting is just too warm for the colors that are in here. So we have to get that together as well. And then in this package, ugh, that's thick. Like I said, we have the rest of the handles here that I'm going to put on. Hey y'all, know that y'all probably like, girl, hold on, hold on, let me wipe y'all off really quick. Okay, is that better? All right, y'all, hey y'all, what's going on? So, as y'all can see, your girl's hair is done. I did my hair literally like 30 minutes ago. Um, I'm actually on my way out to eat with my girl. Bianca um, we're gonna go to this place it's a Asian uh, place so I think that the food will be really good um, we don't really do like different place no, I don't want to say different places but, but just like different foods we normally stick to like regular like American or we may do um, uh, tacos because <laughs> y'all know black people black people love tacos but um, we're gonna do Asian today and I'm so excited because I've really been wanting some Asian food so bad, like just to go to an Asian restaurant. Um, I don't know why, but I've just been craving it. So I'm excited. I've never been to this place before, but obviously I'm gonna bring you guys with me. Ooh, I'm gonna bring y'all with me so, you know, y'all can see what the vibes are. But y'all, it has been raining non-stop. Like on and off, on and off, on and off. I think we're getting the last bit of the hurricane. Um, so yeah, it's been raining. It's, it's very like sticky, um, humid outside. So yeah, I mean, that sucks. That's not really going out weather, but we're gonna make the best of it. Um, for my hair, I actually did a quick weave. Y'all know I have been loving quick weaves and they're just so convenient it did not take me long at all to do this quick weave so yeah i really need to get my um car stand again because this is annoying but yeah i had a client this morning and yeah that was pretty much it i think the last time y'all saw me yesterday i was trying to uh i put the door handles on and then i was attempting to put the kitchen faucet on so I had to run to Home Depot and get the tool that I needed to uh, fit under the wrench. Like, it's a basin wrench. And I ended up getting the right tool, but the wrong size. So I need to return that to Home Depot. And I need to get a bigger size so that I can replace that. I, not me going to Home Depot for something yesterday when I went to go get the basin wrench. Just for me, while I was in Home Depot, to lose $100. Y'all, I lost $100 yesterday. And normally I would be so irritated, I'd be so like annoyed, but the way I was looking at it was, I mean, hopefully the money went to someone who needed it, because I know somebody picked it up. I know they did in this economy. So I'm just praying that, you know, whoever picked it up needed it way more than I did, and that God is gonna use that to just bless someone, so bummer but it's all right so that has been pretty much the rundown yeah we're gonna go out to eat right now um i'm super excited i'm so hungry and i cannot wait to just eat literally in the midst of all of this y'all my nail is popping off right now and this was all this was a trouble nail already so it hurts um well it did hurt but i'm scared that if it like fully comes off that it's gonna hurt all over again so yeah you know we love we love chaos we love chaos it's been forever since i've done a side part 
How are y'all feeling the soft part? Ah! Soft part looks so good. Yeah, I just hope that my hair behaves in this heat because y'all know, summertime, mm -mm. it just, the two just does not mix at all. But anyways, I am about 12 minutes away from the spot. I will see you guys when I get there. Bye. to White Dog Cafe because Pace and Blossoms were actually closed, well their bar, their drink area. The only thing that was open was the restaurant and we wanted a drink. Mm -hmm. What'd you get? Tell them what you got. I got Dog Days. It is brown with some pineapple, simple syrup, and lime. Okay, is it good? It's so good. Rated so 10 out of 10. Which um, one? One through 10. I'm gonna give it a 9 because it's real good. Okay. We got the Barrier Terrier, and this is really good. It's, it's very lemony, so I like it. And then we got the Deviled Egg Flights. But what is this green? This is green. What is it? I'm so curious. Is it like an avocado? Okay, maybe, maybe avocado. avocado. Maybe avocado. Oh, this looks like your little traditional one. Yes, and what this one looks good. One? Maybe like French onion? Like yes. You know what I'm like hard the crispy onions yeah. on top. This one. Okay, I'm excited to eat them. <laughs> the green one. We're gonna try the green one first. Okay, I'm scared. I don't like the smell of it. Okay, <laughs> cheers. Wait, cheers, cheers. I need to say what I'm thinking. It tastes like baby food. I wasn't even saying baby. Mm. That's what they're gonna watch. <laughs> yeah, see? <laughs> you were right. I think the other two will be safe though, because they're like regular eggs. Yeah. Okay. Alright, y'all. So I got the spicy lamb bones with a side of fries. We got some chicken salad trying to make you look nice. <laughs> And she got the Buddha necklace. That's making up for the time. <laughs> yes. I'm crying. This is a balanced photo. I have to take a picture. You do whatever I want. Get whatever I want. Get whatever I need. It's about no. Y'all, we just left dinner at White Dog. It was fun. The food was the food was good. The food was good. Yeah, it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad at all. But we're about to head to the car right now. I forgot it was Friday. Is that my blingers on? I left them on the whole time. <laughs> what was it when you, when you were driving, maybe? Or maybe when you were I don't remember putting them on. I like it around here. It's pretty quiet. It is. So I'm happy it's not raining. 
No way I left my blinkers on for an hour and a half. We both didn't notice it. <laughs> I'm actually on my way home right now and I did end up setting up my uh, my camera tripod. Yeah, so right now I am on my way home. It is currently eight o'clock. It's still like a really good time to just be home um, and to get home. Um, as y'all can see, my curls dropped so much, but we had such a good time. Uh, we definitely talked, caught up on um, some things, you know, like some life chat, girl chat, some things, you know, just life update pretty much. And we just was catching up. It's been a minute since me and her like just went out by ourselves and just had a good time. Um, so yeah, I definitely did not eat all of my food. I got like a box to go and yeah. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do right now. My hair definitely puffed up, so I need to put my um Murray's beeswax on my hair so that it won't get affected by the rain. Because tomorrow I'm going to like a outside type of thing and it's gonna be hot. It's not gonna rain, but it's gonna be hot. So I need to make sure that my hair is prepped for the weather because by B, you ain't gonna catch this leave out not prepared or prepped, okay? Like it was today. Definitely caught slipping. It's a cool little Friday night, honestly. Keeping it cute, keeping it cute. So like not used to a side part because I don't really like hair in my face that much. And this is constantly in my face, so I have to like keep like doing this. But it's cute. Side part is eating, definitely. Side part definitely gives like grown, you know, so it still looks cute. Um, but yeah, anyways, I'm about to listen to my music while I vibe out and while I'm driving. Come up, get come up, get better.